Justin, it's been so long since I've seen you. <laughs> because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. Way too much shit going on, man. Try going to Blackwell. No. Nope. <coughs> Can we talk to this girl? That's so ironic that Warren <coughs> asked Max to the. Hey, Brooke. How are you? I'm here as usual. By the way, thanks for helping Kate down. Are you okay? I need to find Nathan. Have you seen him around? Ask Warren. I mean, you're going to the movies with him and everything. Come on, Brooke. Don't be that way. Nathan was suspended, but he should still be on campus. Warren's not good enough for you? Okay. I saw Nathan pissed and walking off campus earlier. Good luck getting that date, Max. Golly. I might feel better taking your drone for a quick flight. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Really? I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive-in. Talk to you later, Max. That's so ironic wow, that Warren man. asked Max to the drive-in. I had to clear away another batch of dead birds today. Someone's salty. I think everything is changing here. How are you doing, Max? Been a tough week. I know. Yes, it has, Samuel. How are you? Sad and confused, like everybody else in Arcadia Bay. You look like you have a lot of questions, wow. too. Wow, this dude is creepy. I definitely have questions about what's happening to the animals in Arcadia Bay. Oh, many do. These poor creatures have no choice in what happens to them. Mm, dead birds. What do you think about all those dying birds? Samuel had to bury dozens near the Tabanga. Is that cool with the Tabanga? We'll find out if the souls of the bird move on. Not we can prove it. It's so ominous. Unless it's fate. Then it doesn't matter. Beached whales? How can anybody explain all those poor beached whales? My dad was a fisherman, and he'd take me out to hear the whales sing. Now they... they just cry. They're not alone. They're not alone these days. I feel so powerless. Oh, no. You're the opposite of powerless, Max. You think so, Samuel? You and Arcadia Bay are connected by time and tide. So, next time I have a question, I'm coming to you. Squirrels. That sounds kind of creepy, like well, he I'm knows glad to see your squirrels are still something. healthy and happy on the campus. Me too. If something happened to them, Oh. Not as long as you're here to take care of them, Samuel. The only thing that calms them is food. <laughs> Lots of food. Which reminds me th that I have to feed them now. As a scientist, I'm fascinated. All right, guys. Michelle Grant. I'm very worried. Arcadia Bay is scared too. Uh, look at the and the animals. All right. Not to mention poor Kate Marsh. I'll be right back. We all need to look out for each other these days.
speak to her. Hi, Miss Grant. Max, you always show up when I'm talking about you. And I swear, it's not about that petition you didn't sign. I was looking for Nathan Prescott, and I thought he might be in your class. Mr. Prescott has no class at all after his suspension. I didn't think you were friends. You probably know him better. I've tried. Nathan is a Prescott, and with that comes a lot of baggage. Too much for one teenager. This week was the proof. Principal Wells did the right thing. I know. Nathan needs real help. Yes, he does, Max. I did try once, but Mr. Prescott didn't appreciate my help. I did see Nathan leaving the campus looking angrier than usual, so... Maybe it's good you haven't found him. Recent events? I was hoping you could explain some of these crazy things happening in Arcadia Bay. If I could, I'd be collecting my Nobel Prize in Science today. I haven't been able to wrap my mind around that eclipse, much less the snow in Wales. I think this is beyond science. Nothing is beyond science except for our lack of knowledge. We may never know why, but that doesn't change reality. I am worried about reality. I feel like it's changing right in front of us. You and Samuel both. We were talking about that before you came over. Our planet is changing, but it's not mystic. It's erosion. So, you don't think this could be some kind of prophecy or something? Max, you know how fascinated I am by Arcadia Bay legends. But I haven't found any apocalyptic signs yet. Unless you count those end-of-the-world posters. Unless you know something I don't. What about wormholes and chaos theory? I like the time travel stuff. The only wormholes in Arcadia Bay are underground. And chaos theory is just that. But if this is about time travel, sign me up. Would you really change time? Not after reading that Bradbury story, A Sound of Thunder. I won't give it away, but it involves dinosaurs and butterflies. Time is like a thread, Max. One tug and it all can unravel. Kate. Wow, she got all deep and I stuff. I don't think surveillance would have helped Kate Marsh. Who needs surveillance when we have Maxine Caulfield? You did a wonderful thing. And now we have to make sure Kate gets the help she needs. Do you need to talk to a counselor? No, thanks. Uh, no, no thanks, Miss Grant. I have my best friend and my parents. For now. I'm happy to hear that, Max. Just don't ever be afraid to talk to somebody, okay? I wish Kate had come to me. I had no idea what she was going through. Kate was drugged at the Vortex Club party and bullied by them until she ended up on the roof. How do you stop that? Shut down that damn Vortex Club for a start. I don't mean to get riled up, but that party should have been postponed. It's extremely tasteless given what happened with Kate. Do the Prescotts have anything to do with the Vortex Club? I mean, they don't get all their money from car washes. No, they don't. But membership has its privileges. Especially when your father is Blackwell's biggest sponsor. This elitist nonsense has no place here. You're right. I, I just wish this could be the school that I dreamed about before I came here. I hear you, Max. I love seeing you and Warren and all my students at your best here. But you're all too young to be so cynical. But you truly give me hope. I'm sorry, Miss Grant. I, I have to get going. I I'll see you later. It's always good talking to you, Max. Okay, I still haven't found out where... Coast is clear. It would be so cool if you and me were going to school here together. But now you can have Mr. Jefferson all to yourself. Ugh, you suck. Now let's get into Blackwell Ninja mode. Uh-uh. Creeping on the teacher. It's 
so lame. They don't have co-ed dorms here. Yes, because I want Nathan Prescott in the room next door. Good point. Wait here. Give me the signal if Nathan or anybody shows up. I won't let you down, Batmax. Now I just have to find Nathan's room. Who needs a dorm map anyway? At least I can see that Nathan isn't in room 106 or 108. I want to say he's in room 104. Wow. I want to say he's in room 104. Course. That's why no shits were given. Okay, <laughs> Evan maybe rolls. not. Nope, it can't be him. That's eh, one eleven. This can only be Nathan's room. Now I need to find Nathan's phone, or anything with clues. What the hell was he watching? Camera. That monochrome camera is brand new and costs about six grand. <laughs> Bastard. That's so cute and ironic. I can't believe Nathan oh, still damn. has it around. Lame. I thought Victoria had the photo bling, but once again, the Prescott's rule. I don't think this prescription has helped Nathan. Damn, dude's got alcohol and everything. Photos. A book. I don't think one book can guide the press. Right that is so Chloe. Oh my God, Chloe. Nathan 
clearly has his fetish down. Wow. Whale songs? Maybe this is the only soothing thing Nathan ever hears. Must be the lamp Chloe broke when Nathan drugged her. Okay, we'll look at the projector in a second. Damn, Nathan. That's a nice shot. Nah, not quite yet. If only all Ain't not gonna be much, not much longer. It's so damn creepy, but the guy has his own style. Dickhead stole one of my selfies. Nathan likes his tortured subjects way too much. These films all have a dark pattern. I can rewind if he sh Holy shit. That's the gun Nathan used on Chloe. A gift from 